एवरीवन इट्स मी एस एम आरिफ वेलकम इन यू टू माय न्यू फोटोशॉप ट्यूटोरियल्स एंड टुडे आई विल शो यू द अर्बन टाइप आउटडोर पोर्ट्रेट फोटोग्राफी सो आई गॉट दिस इमेज लास्ट वीक इन द जोमना फीचर पार्क एट आवर सिटी सो बिफोर इमेज वाज लाइक दैट आई गॉट दिस वन लाइक दैट एंड आफ्टर एडिंग द पीस एट आई गॉट दिस वन एंड देन आई जस्ट अप्लाइड अनदर फिल्टर फ्रॉम द निक कलेक्शन देन द लाइट सन ऑफ द स्टप्स विच इज द लेवल्स एंड फाइनली आई गॉट दिस आउटपुट सो हाउ टू मेक लाइक दैट लेट स्टार्ट द ट्यूटोरियल इफ यू आर न्यू इन माई चैनल प्लीज डू सब्सक्राइब एंड हिट द बेल आइकन फॉर द न्यू नोटिफिकेशन क्लोजिंग इट आउट एंड फाइल एंड ओपन अप हेर इज माई इमेज विच इज लाइक दैट एंड या प्लीज कंट्रोल जे फॉर द कॉपी ऑफ दिस लेयर एंड आई will apply the filter and camera filter that is the xmp file in this layer so i'm giving the name main and then go to the filter camera filter you know camera filter is a plugins of the photoshop so if you are the user of the cs version you have to install it manually please check it out for the downloading in my video description and those who are the user of the cc version that is the creative cloud version you are getting this one by default so after that you will get a small menu over here go to the load settings options and then i made a preset which is the outdoor sanjida the model name and just yeah you are getting like that so here are lots of settings and let's discuss the settings what i have just done here here is the temperature that is 7 and the exposure point minus 0.04 or 40 and minus 100 highlight you can make the highlight up or down it's totally up to you which flavor do you like and the blacks that is minus 9 and clarity 5 and variance i just made it plus 12 and after that no tone curves i used here uh, so no value over here and then the detailing the sharpening amount or other steps here is the sharpening amount 28 and the the radius that is 1 and detail 25 and luminance 26 and luminance of detailing that is 50 after that hsl panel which is most important for the photographs Uh, photography editing and here i made it like uh, 84 minus 84 plus 29 18 and here plus 13 plus 14 that is the luminance luminance is how light will be the color or you know, the how blink the color will be and the saturation how deep the color will be and that is 59 red and orange that is minus 13 yellow 23 minus 23 actually plus 16 for the blue and hue i made the blue aqua aqua color that is 5, 35 minus 35 and then split toning highlight and shadow you know what will be the highlight color and what will be the shadow color it defined with the split toning so highlight color value is 102 and saturation 13 and the shadow color value that is 245 and the saturation 12 no lens correction issues and here i made it dehaze just because of it was like that but i made it plus 48 and the vignetting minus 8 and the uh, like uh, midpoint that is 50 and the feather 50 that's good and then finally the camera calibration here are three primary colors that is the red green and blue and first one is hue red hue that is 53 plus 53 and uh, green primary that is 18 and hue of the blue primary color that is minus 42 and all the saturation is zero and hit okay you just got the massive change of the photographs yeah the before one was like that and after one you are getting like that so here is some spots so uh, maybe some water or cold drinks just uh, fallen down that's why i'll just remove that how to do that go to the spot healing brush tool and just select the continuer options and make the size of the brush that is 100 pixel and 9% that's good and just select once here 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 and here as well so it's gone now that's good and here as well so be careful when you are removing this one and yeah that's good yeah that's fair enough
that's fine and now i'll go to the filter nick collection and color effects pro 4 so this one is another plugin of the photoshop for the filters a bunch of filters and other stuffs nick collection if you want to get the nick collection download link please check out my video description all the uh, things i'll just provide it in my video description from here uh, i'm using the cross processing here the cross processing and lots of method over here you can use one of them and for this image i used here y02 that is the aqua like um, urban look for these photographs and hit the ok button it will take time to load it up and loading time depends on your pc configuration actually so be patient to when this one is loading it's almost done and it will give you the final output yeah that's fine now i'll just adjust the color by the help of the levels go to the adjustment layer and go to the levels options and make it a little bit like that and a little bit like that so before one was like dull type image which one is the prominent which one is not prominent it's defined like that but in this image you are getting like that so uh, here is another portion to disturbing element that is this thing so i want to remove that so go to the spool go to the spot healing brush tool again and just remove that so when you are removing this be careful so like that part by part you have to remove so that's good so it will take time when you are removing that otherwise uh, it will disturb you to like that so yeah that's fine so you can make more purify or you can give more time to remove that so that is the thing and another thing is that the uh, belly is like um, like not good here so i want to make it like uh, uh, remove the fat like that so go to the filter and go to the liquify tool and i'll just make it uh, in a downside so select here the Paga tool or patcher patch cut tool or patch cut tool whatever you can tell it this one and just make it like down type yeah that's good if you want to make the boost size increase you can use that a little bit it will be amazing to this and hit the ok button so you are getting the ultimate changes of this so before one was like that and after one you're getting like that so ultimately you have done the perfect things for this image so hope that you learn a lot from this tutorial and if you did please thumbs up and share with a friend and if you have any kind of question query or request please do comment on my video comment section and don't forget to subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon for the new notifications and check out my video descriptions for the resource file and the plugins download link so until the next video i am sending out today bye bye